m'appelle Maureen O'Neill, je suis la présidente euh, de la Fondation canadienne pour euh, l'amélioration des services de santé. Our new name, the Canadian Foundation for uh, Healthcare Improvement, or CFHI, reflects the importance that we place on our role as a catalyst in uh, hopefully accelerating healthcare improvement. Our mandate is to collaborate with healthcare partners and decision makers across the country in order to accelerate change, and many of you are here this morning. Notre thème de cette année est, euh, est clairement indiqué sur les programmes. Les services de santé axés sur les patients et leurs familles et l'efficacité. Deux objectifs complémentaires, un peu de questions là-bas, mais quand même c'est la question qu'on va discuter aujourd'hui. Certaines innovations montrent clairement que la qualité des soins, l'efficacité et une approche axée sur les patients et les familles ne sont pas du tout incompatibles. Finding ways to uh, achieve healthcare efficiency, reduce costs and improve patient experience are multi-pronged goals widely shared by all of us. And we believe they can be attained, otherwise we would not have gathered everybody together. Achieving meaningful and sustainable improvement to healthcare requires shifts in the way healthcare is financed, organized, managed, and delivered. As well, change must be informed by public, patient, family engagement. Indeed, we can expect a significant push for change from the no longer deferential patients and their families, and this should be applauded. It seems that the boomers get their way as they kind of steamrolled through the decades, through the system, and uh, I don't think it's going to be different with the healthcare system. The 2013 CEO Forum Partners join us in supporting a patient-centered model of care and we all, as we all seek greater efficiency and continuity of servants, services for patients and their families. Our speakers today will tell us how they're doing things differently and achieving excellent results. They're making implementation breakthroughs in their practices, in their organizations, in their health regions, and their provinces. We'll get a snapshot from Ipsos Reid on what Canadians as patients think about the accessing the care they need and the value of the care they receive. We'll hear Jeffrey Simpson's take on the huge changes and real choices that Canadians face for achieving efficiencies in healthcare. And we'll get an up-close view on several novel approaches to care and how resource reallocation is actually transforming care. Today's discussion is important. How we learn and how we spread what we learn. While we're hosting the CEO Forum, we do it in partnership, in association with the Association of Canadian Academic Healthcare Organizations, the Canadian Institute for Health Information, the Canadian Medical Association, the Canadian Nurses Association, and we also want to thank all our partners and our, our event sponsors, who include the Canadian Partnership Against Cancer, Accreditation Canada, and the Canadian Agency for Drug and Technology, Drugs and Technology and Health. I would also like to thank in advance, but I know he's such a great performer, I, it's no risk to thank him in advance, Dr. Terry Sullivan, our chair today, and in addition to his skills on the podium, he is uh, the faculty head of the EXTRA program, the Executive Training for Research Application program, of which we are so proud. Je suis certaine que vous apprécierez la journée. Je vous remercie. Et Terry, over to you. Thank you. <laughs> 